Hey everyone, my name is Ferizad, your Excel expert, and today I will show you the most important Excel shortcut. These 20 Excel shortcuts will help you to navigate around the workbook super fast and easy. Let's go. The first group of shortcuts that I want to show you are shortcuts to navigate around the spreadsheet. You can move from cell to cell by clicking on it. Or you can use an arrow key to go to left, right, down, and up. If I press Ctrl arrow key pointing right, I can jump from this cell to the last column of my data. If I press Ctrl arrow key pointing up, I can jump from this cell right to the top of my table. If I press Ctrl arrow key point and left, I will move to the first column of the data. If I press Ctrl arrow key point and down, I will move to the last cell of the data in my table. However, if I have blank cells in my column, like here for example, I will be jumping to the cell of data right before empty cell to the next cell of data. Now let's take a look how to highlight cells. To highlight range of cells, all you need to do is to press shift and arrow keys, right and down. To highlight range of cells all the way till the end of our table, press Ctrl, shift, arrow key, right and down. If there are blank cells in the column or row, you will need to press arrow key a few times. So it will be Ctrl, shift, arrow key down, few times like that. If you want to highlight whole table, you can press Ctrl, shift, arrow key, right and down, or even faster, just press Ctrl, A. To highlight whole row, use shortcut, shift, space. To highlight whole column, Ctrl, space. Now let's take a look how to insert columns and rows and how to delete them. Let's say I need to insert row between row number 19 and 20. You need to highlight row number 20, which is shift space, and then press Ctrl plus or Ctrl shift plus. A new row will be inserted above the highlighted row. To delete row, just press Ctrl minus. Same way with the columns. Highlight column, Ctrl space, and then Ctrl plus or Ctrl shift plus, and column will be inserted to the left of highlighted column. Now to delete it, just press Ctrl minus. Just like that. Now, Let's say I need to apply a filter to my table and then copy filter data to the new worksheet. Let me show you how to do it quickly using shortcuts. First, we need to highlight the table, which is Ctrl A. Now we can apply it filter, Ctrl Shift L, filter data you need. Now copy the data, Ctrl C, and press Shift F11 to insert new worksheet. Now just paste it, Ctrl V, and you're done. Good job, guys. You just learned the most important 20 Excel shortcuts. If you will practice and you master the shortcuts, you will work in Excel super fast and efficient. You can get the practice file in the pinned comment below. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Follow for more.